our feet we crush rejection under our feet we crush pain under our feet we crush shame under our feet it is what it should go it is what it should go it is what we crush shame under our feet we crush lack under our feet crush crush we crush you devil we crush you satan we crush you satan under our feet crush under our feet we crush you under our feet we crush you we crush you under our feet we crush under our feet obo pangisa te wali muntu asobola kweyamba mwe namuli mbupangisa te wali aye na uwe muri nyali ya yesu under our feet shaba baba baba la 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 Oh, oh, angula rero, oh angula rero, oh angula rero. Ndabe chisote chifa, ndabe chisote chifa, ndabe chisote chizikiri la muriro, ndabe chisote chisasemere bibio, ndabe chisote chisasemo opportunityo, ndabe chisota, ech 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 chisasema checkio. Check. after you delivered some materials after you delivered some goodies but they keep forgetting oh you are not signing the check but you said I have a leader I are not we are but you said I'm off on a visible or water on the area yes it's a chita one you already know we are it's a chita one you already know we are it's a chita one you're a destiny here a pause a month to sue is a chin to attend a year cool or water of Fire, <laughs> Gayamba Bako Linda Yes, oh, Linda Yes, Linda Yalina Amani. I am Baba Koye. Oh, Lee. Over one on Ama Futa, over one on God Judegwe, Bamu Yokusa. Linda Yesu. Linda Yesu. Ofuna Ama Futaga festival season. Puri chiba de chiku tezo muri dogu jocha agayamba bakoye puri chisota e chiba de chiteke da ba customer mumuri yango puri chisota e chiba de chite bisoro yo. Go was up was in Buzzi was if I was up was in Cocosanga as if you could soup it. You just see your animal die. Now you are you wait, she so I'm a footaga katonda gachi zura kat. I'm a footaga katonda gachi kola kokat. Eche chi sote che grigi samun kokozo. Fire, yeah, 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 murina, yes. Put you out as omri. Put you out as omri, murina, yes. Choke away. Eche sote chi go a customer. 
Oria janga sekula wona yena abera diverted wali wechi mukanga olwale lechi sotecho tuchuwele somulio wele somulio wele somulio wele somulio wele somulio wele somulio chigende fire 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 chitolo muliyo chitolo muliyo chitolo muliyo Manikemi kono mubanga Buli muntu alote misota Everyone who dreams next. Whenever you have a dream about a stake, you lose something. Even when you have a good deal that you are about to go, that the you either dream about the big snakes or the small ones. And something that you've been expecting fails. Whatever you've been waiting for does not come to full. The Lord has told me that that snake eats eats. Because if the snake eats, in revelation, the woman bought a child. When the child has been just born, the big snake came and ate up the child. That child represents. Oh, your man, a child that came again. Baby represents a miracle. Oh, your man, a child that. That baby represents something that has been lost. It represents profits in your business. That devil does not stop you from it. But he does not let you for a full year you work. But you cannot touch the fruit of your labor. But you cannot touch the fruit of your labor. Because there is a snake that keeps waiting. Keeps waiting. When you give birth, it comes and eats. When it came, Konomo Bang. May the fire of God. May the fire of God consume every destiny killer. Consume every destiny eater. In the name of Jesus. This week, Weekend. let the fire go ahead of you. This entire month of December, fear not. There is a fire. There is a fire is that is clearing your way. Whatever has been working, it's going to go ahead and it will consume it. He will level all the unleveled places. He will make her way has not been away. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Olinda Yesu Linda Yesu Ya Lina Agayamba Bakoye Jagala kubera o ori, jagala kubera o Yesu, jagala kubera, jagala kubera o, o jagala kubera o. Ania ya galaba nangi. Toi mbiranze mugambe mukama Chimugambe Oh nyagala kubera Nabali emabega Jagala kubera o Nabali mutente mugambe Kulira njagala nyonze Dadi jagala kubera o, o, kulira jagala nyo, jagala kubera o, e, 
Katonda tari ndeka Oli katonda tari ndeka Aha E oli katonda tari ndeka Imba nawe O oli katonda tari sula o no no Oli katonda tari swaza, aha. E oli katonda tari vamu neta. E oli katonda tari sula wo apana. Oyo Yesu bonye ncha. Hey, orogo maya yuda. Yesu munye nye cha ani aimbira Yesu eh tata eh oyo Yesu munye nye cha cha tule nawe omwana gwendiga eh Yesu Yarwane Taro Zangi Hey Oh 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 Yimbira Yesu 
Yarwani Taruzangi. Ah, yeah. Oh, 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 Seruani dantaro, oh la yesu yo, nange na nuani ra. Hey, hey, aluane taro zange, aluane taro zange, yesu aluane taro zange, aluane taro zange, aluane taro. Alwane ntaro yawe Yesu alwane ntaro Alwane ntaro tata Alwane ntaro zange Alwane ntaro zange Ewe bale kulwana ngantaro We bale kulwana no wangula Wevale kurwana na banumba Wevale kurwana no ba wangula Kurwana no wangula Yesu kurwana no wangula Yesu kabya ebin kabya Service. We don't announce it because because of the prayer waves in the Sabala, Nasa, and Yet it's a very powerful service. So I thank you when I find many of you here in the morning. It means you discovered a secret. May the Lord hear our prayer. Amen. You may have your seat. Let's appreciate uh, the team that wakes up so early to set up the service. Alex, Pastor Michael, Timo, and uh, Sam, and the entire team. Now, if a man and a snake are in one room, good morning, by the way. If a man and a snake are in one room and they've not seen each other, he who sees the other first kills the other. True or false? It's not even to debate about Right, Michael? If the man sees the snake first, the snake has no option, but they have to kill it. If the snake sees man first, still the snake will strike the man. There are two, eh? Com there are two official enemies. A man cannot see snake and says, oh, there comes a snake, let me go to bed. Are with me? Even the snake cannot see a man and says, it's fine, he, oh, let everyone mind his own business. If a man sees a snake Passing by, he cannot go to bed. 
Because these children are not safe. Until the snake is dead. I, I, I've never seen someone who says, Oh, let's go to bed. It's, it's just a snake just passed by here. Even if it takes the entire night. Until they find the snake and kill it. There will be no rest until it is dead. No man can go to bed and say, let's, let's sleep, we'll, we'll, we'll find it in the morning. Praise God. Amen. Church, praise God. So I want to tell you, two things kill a snake. Here in Africa, in case you just bump into each other, a man and a snake. Either you get a, 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 a small stick, or you get a, a rock. This is, the, this is the easiest way to kill a snake. Or, or you get a, a, a rod. Even if you are a captain, or, or, or a big army official, you, you don't come with your machine gun and, and, and fire the entire house because there's a snake. Because the bullet can hit your own child or wife. I've never seen a commander doing all the, eh, the training things like because they are looking for a snake. You either get a rock uh, a, a stick or you get a stone. And also mostly they aim at the head. Right? Most of the people who want to kill a snake they, they look for the head because once you crush the head you can sleep in your bed safely because you crushed its head. Amen. Amen. So, where I live, I live, I have a lot of trees and we, 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 we always encounter snakes. In my house. So, so we, we, we have to have rocks around. Life will have, sometimes there's snakes following us. Right? But in Luke chapter 10, verse 19, Jesus Christ says, I have given you power over snakes. I thought someone was going to say, Amen. Let me repeat it. I have given you power and authority to step on snakes. Someone say amen. Amen. I've given you power and authority. I've given you authority to step on snakes and kill them. Look, I've given you authority over all powers of the enemy. 
And you can walk among snakes and scorpions. And you crush them. Nothing will injure you. Someone say Amen. Amen. So it means as a child of God you can step on snakes and you kill them. So, lift up your hands in Jesus' mighty name in case there is any snake in your life tonight as I speak we kill that snake in Jesus name we kill that snake in Jesus name I said we kill that snake in Jesus name I said we kill that snake in Jesus name we kill that demon in Jesus name we kill that disease in Jesus name we kill that problem in Jesus name we kill that cancer in Jesus name we kill that addiction in Jesus name I said we kill that HIV in Jesus name we kill that evil dream in Jesus name we kill that poverty in Jesus name we kill those deaths in Jesus name in the mighty name of Jesus we kill that dream in Jesus name someone say amen amen so Christ has given you power to kill what wanted to kill you. Yes, you can kill it according to Luke chapter 10, 19. Before Jesus Christ came, the snakes had power over you. But now that you have Christ, you can force out whatever forced your mother out of her marriage. I always tell people, I was even telling a friend of mine yesterday, when I was younger, I used to be so judgmental. You know, I, I didn't understand a lot of things. How can a Christian divorce? How can a married man uh, eh, be so unfaithful and get another wife? I remember when I was younger, I met um, a young girl who had had a child of a preacher I knew. A young, I was a young pastor. Yeah. I think it was a secret. She told me this is a secret that pastor pregnanted her, and I think I spoke that secret everywhere I went. Young and stupid. Can you imagine Pastor Swanzo? How can a Christian drink? A lot of judging. But the more I've grown and the temptations I've made in life, I realize it takes the grace of God to stay. On the path. And the salvation is for every day. You can't say, you know, I got born again 30 years ago, that's it. Even today in the morning, his mercies are renewed for somebody. It's not that now I'm saying uh, it's okay to do whatever. But recently, 
I made a joke, Michael. I said, uh, uh, some, some churches, if I was part of some churches, I would sing a nagwa. If I, I was part of some churches, I would have fallen or backslided. As a church is I realize even the people we judge, why did your mother leave? When you grow up, you're going to forgive your mother. I promise you. You will understand because look at you. You are also married, but how many times have you felt like you want to pack and leave? just like your mother the more you grow up you get to understand why did your father leave you my kids can come and mess me up and I tell myself am I talking to you whoever said parenting is easy parenting is not easy but I realize some of the things that affected our fathers they were some forces that overpowered them am I talking to you Amen. talk to me am I talking to you Amen. Some of the things that happened to your mother. Why she ended up with different men and different uh, children. She didn't intend that. But every time she got married, there was a certain force that forced her out. All men were leaving her. Am I talking to you? Amen. And she was left with children and she has no option. So those are the forces. When you, when, when you grow up, you start to feel the same forces against you that your father fought. Same temptations. But your father was weak. Because he didn't have Luke 10 19. I give you power over every force scorpions and serpents, and you shall walk on them and you shall kill those snakes. Somebody say, I receive power. The power to rise when you fall. Do you know some of you? You can go through a certain situation and you go back home and your grandmother is not surprised. Oh, Jaja, my, my grandmother, I can't believe uh, he is beating me. My husband is beating me. And your grandmother is like, hmm, now we were beaten. Oh, my business is all down, and your, your father knows all businesses have been going. People have been getting money and dying poor in that family for the last 350 years or 100 years. Some of the things we go through, they are not new to our grandfathers. Before you know it, you get to realize that your grandmother knows that snake. They are, the people in that house don't keep a marriage. They can't keep a man. And she can read for you a list of how many ma failed marriages in that clan. Do you know there are some families they know each year they must bury someone, one or two. It's even, they even prepare before the beginning, beginning of the year. It's been a snake in that house that married them and they can't overpower it. If I'm talking to you, come on, talk to me, say amen. amen. Some families, they get money, but by the time they die, they are as poor as a church mouse. It's a snake in the family. Do you know some, some families die the same age time? Age. Eh? 
How should, I, how should I say? They don't exceed a certain age. Blacket. Thank you. They don't. Do you know some families can die of the same disease? Over, over 20 members of a family can die of HIV. Or accidents. Thank God for Jesus Christ. I repeat, thank God for Jesus Christ. Who says, now that you are in me, you are my child. And if you remain in me, and I remain in you, quote that word, remaining. Don't let anything force you out of Jesus Christ. I said, don't let anything force you out of Christ. When you remain in me and I remain in you, somebody say remaining. A good season can take you out of Christ. A bad season can take you out of Christ. That's why the Bible says from the rising of the sun till it sets down, the name of the Lord should be praised. Nothing shall separate us from the love of God. Whether I am getting, whether my business is doing good or my family is not doing good, I remain. If you remain, then you can ask for whatever you want. Then I'll give you power. I said I give you power. I give you power to step on that snake and you kill it and nothing will happen to you. You are let me declare. You are going to be the first person to break that force. Okay, some of you have attended so many services that you no longer even understand what we say. But what I'm saying is, we can kill that snake. We can kill that snake. It can die and it will not touch your children and it will not touch your wife and it will not touch your marriage. It will not touch your business. It will not touch your body. It will not kill you because we are anointed to kill what wanted to kill you. In the might name of Jesus, somebody say power good praise God amen do you know why I sometimes get angry at you because some of you you are you you are some people attend a lot of services that they no longer feel the power they're like yeah let's wait for another service come on am I talking to you amen Somebody say, I've been given power. You've been given power to overcome what your mother did not overcome. Let me preach again. Your marriage will stand. Your children will grow. Nothing will force you out of that house. Hey, the devil will not take your husband from you. You've been given power to make sure your wife stays with you until old age. We kill that snake. I said we kill that snake. We used to sing a song that I choose to be holy, set apart for you. You know, you can be set apart. Pastor Mike, in the case of the man in you, all the good things you are going to do, what you no, you can be set apart. I service at Dako. I'm you to You have to and get him. 
Budi wola mu mtu atava mchia chingo li musumba wela likirile. Agina kubavu wazi. Kubatakola. Tasiga. Atabuli service ajivela. Numbu uzori achi. Mkama atulabilila. Ngevi nyonyi mubango. Olishi nyonyi. Gendo okolei. Katonda jaku ya mbo tre. Obu, obu, obu. Chora services awa notu wazi chusa. Tuziteka yoku machanyo na lagulo nyo. Our services are there. We have them in the morning and the evening so people can have time to Bazi come mama yumba. So they go build houses. So they can pay fees for their children. Your children will not hate salvation. So they can be of help to the house. So they can build good houses. So the blessing can be upon them and the children of their children. Na yaba muku bo linga nyinabe njoke nanga nina nga kubye kakumbi ka aktuwaka you will be set apart. Later, Navy, I repeat, you can be set apart. Eranda Gulanti or Gom Sota Guabo, Jaja Jao, Neko Jao, Nesengao, Nayegue, Katonda Quado, Visa, Mulina Romana, Yes Christo, Okuangule, Chintu Chale Matatao, Okuangule, Mwengue, Wamwe, Okuangula, Walajue, Wamwe, Okuangulo, Wesiwe, Wamwe, Okutom Soto, Gokulondola, Mulina Yes Christo, Yakmana, Katono Mulamu, Tutechiwa Deche, Chibata, Nevichimachi Musaigo, Nevichimachi Magumbago, Nevichimachi Mumisuajo, when Mulina Yes Christo, Rale. We've been given power to step on that snake and we kill it in the name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus. We kill that demon, we kill that snake in the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, sister. Let me let me let me say three more things. Jesus says, Look. I have given you authority over the powers of the enemy. But if you read verse 17, Luke 10, 17, that's when it makes sense. When the 72 disciples returned, they joyfully reported to him, Lord, even the demons obey us when we use your name. <laughs> oh God, I, I need I need three more minutes. Did you hear that? Even the demons obey us when we use your name. 